Good morning everyone! I'm back! Yes, darling! And uh, today I'm going to be doing uh, something that uh, one of my subscribers uh, suggested, uh, Anna. So Anna, I'm going to do this one for you, darling. I'm going to be putting some golden highlights in this beautiful hair of mine, okay? Now, I have to be careful, so I'm going to be using Kevin Murphy uh, Cream Lightener, which is very uh, gentle to the hair with 20 volume. So I'm just going to be getting everything set up and I'm going to come back and show you my tray full of goodies, okay guys? So don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so, darling. Like the video and activate the bell so I can get you notified whenever I upload new content. And yes, darling, do you like my new tank top? This is my bleaching tank top. I never use this, really. It's like only to sleep at night. Uh, so it's very soft. Okay, darling, let me just get everything set up and I'll show you all my tools, okay? Yes! Okay, so if I'm gonna be using this one to one and a half, uh, if I use 20 grams of this uh, lightener, then I will use uh, 30 grams uh, of 20 developer. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna use 30 volume instead of 20. And I'm just gonna put uh, all effects lower down the volume. But I, I really wanna have some insurance on my hair because I know it's if I do uh, 30 volume straight up, it's gonna break because I have so much process on my hair already. Yeah, so let me just set up everything on the table. Yes. So I'm, I'm making a batch of 15 grams of the cream lightener. This is it for uh, the lightener that I put into my Kevin Murphy bowl. Yes, and I'm, I'm gonna mix it really well and then I'm gonna add the other effects. So like I was telling Anna, my subscriber, you know, I have every color in the rainbow in my hair. Uh, platinum blonde, silver, uh, red, black, dark purple, everything changes. Today I, I say I may not do this, may not want it, may not like this, but you know what, maybe tomorrow I'll like it. Okay, so I'm gonna add one third of an ounce, that much. So it's looking too watery for me, so I'm gonna add more product, more lightener. Wow, I'll add a little bit more of the lightener. I like to use this kind of brushes when I put uh, lightener in my hair because it's very small, uh, the, the bristles are not too long and I love the way it applies. Okay, so I'm gonna, this is the bleach. And I'm gonna be using my Framar uh, foils, which I love. Over here, let me just bring this light back. Okay, so I'm gonna put the table right over here. Because right in the front here, I have a mirror. So I'm just gonna put the face in the mirror. The lightener uh, on damp hair. So I'm just gonna go to the sink and I'm gonna uh, like put some water on my head, on my hair, because I want, it's easier for you to uh, handle wet hair than dry hair. Wait, and I'll be right back. So I decided not to get my hair that wet. Uh, on the sink, I'm just gonna use the, the bottle because I want it damp, I don't want it soaking wet. So I'm just gonna... Okay, so I want the hair damp, but not soaking wet. So let's see how I'm gonna do this. It's too much. You see what I told you, I like to have the hair wet. I mean, even this a need more. Let me just put all this hair away. It's difficult for me doing this also because I don't have my glasses on. So I'm just gonna take a small section like this, like baby lights. Just pin this. Push it in. Can you see? Ok, 
Okay. I'm just gonna do this section in here. So let's see how much. And again, I'm, I'm gonna do a slice like this. I'm not gonna weave. Can you see, guys? I'm not pretending that it's gonna be perfect, but it's just something to show you that it can be done by yourself. I mean, you have any, any kind of uh, practice. The way I'm doing it. So now I'm gonna do one in here. Let's see. So I'm just gonna take this section here. And pull. I love this. Okay. This is gonna be tricky. but not impossible. I'm just gonna put one in here and one in here. I'm gonna be like a uh, brick, uh, brick layering, is that how you call it? Yes. So I'm gonna put one in here. Yes. I don't wanna put too much hair. I don't want it to look too fake. So let's see. Still, I think it's too much hair. We are professional, so we, we should be able to, to judge, you know, the thickness of, of the foil. So I'm just gonna add this tiny bit in here. Clean the hands, I don't want to put bleach all over the hair. And the last one is going to be right over here. So yes, guys, you know what? It's send me uh, suggestions like Anna, like Anna did. I think it's too much because you know what? Why not? Anything, any suggestions, you know, I'll take. You know, even though I've done this before, uh, 
it's it's fun to play, you know? It's not that you're doing it on a client, you know, it's just, you know, you do it yourself. And like I told, like I tell everyone, you know, hair is, hair is hair, it always grows back. Okay, so put it here. Thumbnail, yes! Yeah. Now we wait. 20 minutes, okay guys? Okay guys, so uh, depending on how light I get, um, the highlights, that's how I am gonna be toning. Yeah. So this is it. So I'm gonna be using natural and beige and the eyes. It has a little bit of lavender in case it's to counter out the, uh, the brassiness. Warmth of my hair. Again, uh, it all depends on how the hair comes out after the lightening process. Okay, 10 more minutes. And I'm having my coffee. So yeah, guys, so after this, I'm just gonna go upstairs. After I do the color, of course, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go upstairs, take a nice shower, and get dressed, and I'm just gonna go for a walk. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I moved the lights, so in a different angle now, so you don't get the same repetitive background. So yeah, I got some more coffee. This time it's black. Okay, so it's, Five to eleven. I'm gonna start checking now. Let's see. So I'm gonna check this one, which was the first one that I did. Let's see how this one is looking. I think they're all ready. I think this one is ready. Oh yes. You see guys? Yes! Look how fast. Yes! Look how beautiful guys. Can you see? Oh my goodness. Let me rinse this and apply the corner. Can you see? Yes. I'm gonna rinse. It looks really nice, yeah? Uh, restore from Kevin Murphy. Yes, guys, look at that. Oof. Looking cute. I think I'm gonna put eyes because it's, it's too, it's too red for me. So I think I'm gonna do this is the eyes. I'm gonna do five grams of ice and five grams of beige. Three point five volume, thirty grams. Any kind you put any chemical in your hair. If you have the other plex darling, put it on. So we're gonna add the old flex. I'm gonna add half of what I added before. Okay. I remember the other flex gets mixed after the color gets mixed or after the bleach is mixed. I'm gonna be using the Wacom to distribute the hair color. Yes.
Guys, it's welcome. It's amazing. I bought it on Amazon. I'm gonna link it below so you can also get it too. I think it's like uh, fifteen dollars, something like that. It's very cheap, very inexpensive. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's already been color, and color does not lift color. Color lifts only virgin hair. That's the first thing the tissues uh Beautiful. Okay, then that should be enough. I'm just, I'm just putting everything in because since I mixed it, might as well just use it. So I just make sure everything gets well saturated, darling. I don't know how all these people and uh, all the students are doing now in beauty schools uh, because I know that everything is being done online. So, I mean, it's gonna be really tough for them uh, if they get it uh, after they finish school and go in the real world because they have not had the experience of dealing with clients uh, during the school setting. And I think that's the most important uh, aspect of being a, a beauty school that you are putting to the floor to do clients, you know, and you have teachers uh, guiding you on, you know, on how to handle different situations, you know. So, I mean, I feel for them I mean, you spend all this money, I think I paid for my, my course uh, with Paul Mitchell back on 20, I started on 20, uh, I started on January 1st, 2015, and I paid 17,500. And I know when I finished, uh, when I finished school, it was uh, 25,000, 22 or 25,000, I don't know how much, how much is now. So, you know, it's the same. I have another friend, another friend two friends. Uh, first came to Portland, I was going to go to Fagan's school. Uh, I went to Fagan's uh, to interview with a lady. The lady was kind of uh, nasty. Uh, so I decided not to go to the school. So I went to uh, Aveda to, just to check it out. Um, I didn't get the vibe from Avera, Avida, whatever you call it. So then I went to Paul Mitchell, uh, you know, right from the start, and I walked in the door and I felt right at home. So, you know, I met wonderful people, you know. And then I forget, you know, the nicest people, Heidi, Marquita, you know, it's Trevor. Parker. Brittany. She's the nail expert. She was, I mean, she used to be a, the nail expert, right? Um, and now she's working at the, at the Portland Beauty School, I believe. Uh, that's where I met my friend Stacy. Um, and Ray, she was one of the, she was a student and then she became a, a uh, a teacher, a learning leader, whatever you call it, yeah. I mean, I met wonderful people. I'm gonna go upstairs and shampoo my hair and condition. First, I have to do the other place number two, then shampoo and condition, and I'll show you guys the result. This is the best combination to do. It's like a few drops. Wow. Now the hair looks darker in the back because the front has all the light. Guys, this Olaplex 6 and 7 is the bomb. This, this oil is unbelievable. So the way I'm blow drying my hair this is the way I was taught in a Paul Mitchell school. This is called the flat wrap that you use your, uh, your head to dry your hair and then you follow the blow dryer after the brush. So you go side by side and this helps to create volume too. A little bit brassy. 
to my liking, but you know what? I'm I'm gonna get dressed and I'm gonna style the hair and then I'm gonna take you guys outside and because we not we need to see the true colors, darling. Yes. Okay, guys. Let me just get dressed, put a little a little bit of makeup and let's go outside. Yes. Okay, guys. So I got dressed. I'm gonna style my hair again. I'm gonna use the Kevin Murphy uh, on dress. Looking beautiful. Yes! Okay. So always use L time D. Yes. Beautiful. <laughs> Why wait until you get the wrinkles to start treating them, you know? Because it's nothing really that's gonna cure the wrinkles. Unless you go to plastic surgeon, you know, and get a, a chemical pill, or you have to get a laser, or, you know, it's a lot of money down the road. So, you know, if you can avoid it, avoid it, then prevent the damage, why not? Okay. I'm not even gonna look at the camera, but you guys, I've seen it already in natural light, but I don't wanna look at it. I want you guys to be the first ones to judge. Yes. The coffee. Oh, wow. Let's see, let me go in the, in the shadow in here. It's different. Uh, I had to get used to it. I don't know. It's it look. It doesn't look that bad. So I'm gonna leave with this until I get tired of it. Let's see if you guys like it. So you know what? Practice makes perfection. So now I know. For the future and uh, you know what uh, it's it's good to try things on yourself and not on your clients so you know uh, so you can whenever you get a new client or someone that gets asked you for this this process so you know what steps to take in, in the toning on the toning part you know i think i will use a little something more cooler i think it's too reddish for me uh, so let's see um, when I get up tomorrow I'm gonna definitely I'm, I'm gonna definitely gonna change it so but for now guys it is what it is I just got, hope you guys like it and um, send me suggestions do you like it or not put it down uh, in the comment box should I dye back dark brown or should I leave it? Should I turn it into a different color? Yes, guys, just give me your opinions and uh, looking forward for them. Okay, guys, so I'm just gonna, gonna leave it at this. So again, guys, no, you know the deal. Subscribe, like, and activate the bell. And yes, guys, keep sending me ideas. And Anna, thank you for your uh, suggestion. And here it is. Okay, guys, until the next one.